guys so we are back we're back in the fanny literally it is like 20 past three i've just in the afternoon just got the vods out i finished work for bugging it got out of work let's get down here let's get the vods in for a couple of hours let's even get a fish on a bank for you guys so we'll see what we can do hopefully we can get some fish on the bank just what we can do i have picked um a quick easy peg to be honest I am in the shallows, it is a bit of a risk, but uh, it has been a nice day, the sun's been out, so hopefully they're still up here, if they are up here, and let's give it a go, so I've got two rods out towards my left hand side of that pole, where I normally fish, if you haven't seen my channel, have a look back on some of the other videos on this peg, you see I had one of my PBs, well, was a PB last year, and then uh, I broke it again in White Springs then, with uh, another 30 pound, I can't remember exactly how many ounces off the top of my head, but there was literally probably about seven, eight ounces in there, something like that between the two of them. So, so yeah, hopefully one of these rods go off now. I have got one to the tree to my right hand side. It is a bit off. I'll give it an hour. If it's nothing, I'll try to get it a bit closer. I'm about rod length and a half off at the moment. So yeah, as of, I got markers. I'm not wrapping up or nothing. All gone out on the fearful Ronnie rigs. I have put one out on a Manila waff, uh, Manila popper, one out on a nuts uh, uh, wafter. Unfortunately, they've been discontinued as Axis Wangling is now gone. And I've also got one out on a nuts pop up. As I was making the bait for Axis Wangling, any I will be produ producing some bait myself. If any of you guys are interested and want a local pickup, I am in Batalba. Give me a message, I'll sort the bait out. Um, depending on what you want, you can sort of the price. So yeah, other than that guys, happy days. I'll update you in a little bit. Hopefully we have a fish on a bank. So let's let's do it. Right then guys, so not bad. I'm literally just down here for a couple of hours. I'm in the shallows. It's quite mean. Oh, and aggressive. So how about this to start the season? First carp of the year. Not sure on the size yet. Then we'll get him weighed. And uh, we'll sort him out there. We did fall to uh, 12 mil nuts. Ned's bottom bait. As I said, if anyone's after any, give me a message and uh, we we'll see what we can sort out. I guess I'm done. So, yeah, guys. Happy days. How about that start of vlog of the year? First fish in the shallows, still cold. As I said, the sun was up here, so yeah. Happy days. Right then, guys, so we literally just put the corner back off the left hand rod. And now, as I recast and put, sorted that out, that one was just over 13 pound. We've had this beast. Which I, with a barely on this, this girl over here, I think she's a bit bigger. So we will get our weight. We'll see what we can do. I can't believe it. This one fell to a manila pop up off the tree. So yeah, guys, we're <laughs> over there, lads. So, um, two fish on a bank. I mean, yes, it's half past three. The time is half past four. Right, about 20 past three, I got the rods out and set up. So I've been an hour. And now we're on the shallows, it's February, it's, it's not exactly warm, we've had a, a sunniest day and cloudiest afternoon. The wind, as you could probably see in the lake, is howling up towards the shallow end. Just pick this pegs, it's nice and convenient to be honest, didn't do uh, much watercraft, but it's paid off. So, two fish, two commons, first session of the year, get in there. So yeah, the first fish was fifth, was just over 13 pound and the second fish was 15 and a half pound common as well so happy days what's the odds now the fish have gone up in gone up in size nice as two pound rod jump so let's see if we can get more i did have one off the left hand side of the pole or three rod lengths in line with the pole to the left hand side and that was the first one the smaller fish which fell to a 12 mil red's bottom bait one of them little boys them little things there and that was on a volley rig as you know i love to use volley rig so 
pop mates, wafters, pop ups, you name it, I use it and uh, and it works. It pays off me, so it seems always working. I'm not changing something that doesn't work that does that's working like. What's the point? There's no point changing it. So one was on the manila pop up then, which was the bigger one, which is off the tree. To my right, then which is the one which I said it's about rod length and a half, two rod lengths off the tree. So happy days. Hopefully I can update you a bit in a bit again with some more fish. That would be absolutely amazing and I would put this session to a really, really excellent session to start the year. So I have been told there's not many fish that's come out in the last few weeks. So yeah, well it's cold weather what you expect. But I do know there was a 35 pound plus fish caught in the sh uh, in the snags down on the day peg today. I think it was this morning. So happy days for him, I'm well happy. I don't think I'm gonna get many of the bigger ones up here. Hopefully we can, all we could do is try. As, as we've seen in my last vlog, I did have a 30 pounder off this peg. I do love this peg, don't know why. I just, I just do. Quick, convenient. They love it in the summer, it's nice. I'm so glad the Brimmel Angling have cut the trees back now. Make it so much easier to cast here. So happy days, I, I could recommend them. As a club water, they've got a nice uh, another small small pond called the Half on Ponds. I will be doing uh, sessions down there. My next session might even be down there. So yeah, happy days, guys. Hope you update doing a bit. Right then guys, this one might be a little bit bigger again, but, oh, we have got something a little different. Ooh. There's not one of them I pick him up. Did have to pull him a little bit because the snags, but other than that, this is a lovely fish. Oh, look at that. Fucking happy days. So, uh, lovely zipline, yeah. We'll get him weighed in a minute. And, uh, oh, he's still quite, uh, quite lively. So, we'll get him weighed, sort it out. 12 mil bottom bit on that Ronnie rig once again. Same spot on the pole. Happy days. Three fish so far this session. Two commons and this lovely mirror. So let's get let's get a weed. One more. Let's see if we can get on another one on the bank before we go. Happy days. Right then guys. I'm on this. Oh. 24 pound two common. Sorry about lightning, it's just got dark and uh nothing's the best. But hey. What can you say? What a way to end the day. I'm literally just about to pack up and uh, this falls for 12, 12 mil nuds. Happy days. Biggest fish of the day. So I'm going to stop this now, try to get some good light in, try to get some photos and uh, get this fish back. Happy days. What a session. Well then guys, what an end to the session. So we finished off our session with a 24 pound two common. Happy days, what can I say? Literally it is 25 past six. I got you, well I set up and had the vods up by about 20 past half past three. So I've literally caught it three hours and I've done four fish. It's February, it's cold. I'm up the shallows and I just, I can't explain it cannot explain it so three of the fish fell to the 12 mil nuds bottom baits on the varney rigs and one of them fell to the manila pop-up so yeah i did come off after having two fish on the small on the 12 mil nuds and put them all on the 12 mil nuds and uh so yeah two fish off the pole left hand side one off the middle rod one off the left hand rod so 
they, I literally have had fish on them all to be honest and I've had two off the tree so the biggest one the last fish did come off the tree one of them was on the manila pop-up and the other one was on the 12 mil nuts so yeah guys what can I say happy days first fish session on the Fenwad first session of the year what a way to start 2023 fish went up in size went from a th just over 13 to a 15 and a half to a 16 6 to finish it off with a 24 pound 2 happy days cannot go wrong with that for three hours fishing so yeah this might be a short vlog but it's a good one catch you in a bit guys <laughs>